Most of the default settings in Dreamweaver are fine. There are just a couple of changes you should make before working with HTML5. In addition to setting HTML5 as the default document type, you need to change the way Dreamweaver handles italics and bold text. For many years, the conventional wisdom has been to use M and Strong for italics and bold. The idea was to help visually disabled people who use screen readers to listen to the content of web pages. Apparently that was all wrong, so the HTML5 specification redefines how emphasis should be handled. The specification says that M should stress emphasis that changes the meaning of the sentence. It's not a generic italics element. I, on the other hand, should be a span of text in an alternate mood offset from the normal prose, something like a technical term, a foreign expression, a thought or maybe a ship's name. The strong tag is redefined as meaning strong importance that doesn't change the meaning of the sentence. You can even nest strong tags together to give something even greater importance. The B tag is redefined as being stylistically offset without conveying extra importance. Keywords in a document abstract, product names in a review, something like that. So let's change the preferences in Dreamweaver to work with HTML5. To open the Preferences panel in Windows, go to the Edit menu and select Preferences from the bottom. In the Mac version of Dreamweaver, go to the Dreamweaver menu and select Preferences. Alternatively, you can use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl-U on Windows or Command-U on a Mac. The Preferences panel has a large number of categories listed on the left. The general category is the first one that you want to change. Deselect this checkbox marked U strong and M in place of B and I. This changes the default tags that the property inspector uses for bold and italics in line with HTML5 practice. If you still need strong and M, they're available through the text category of the insert panel. To change the doc type, select new document which is down towards the bottom of this list on the left. And change default document type from XHTML 1.0 transitional to HTML5. Now while I'm in the Preferences panel in the New Document section, I'd just like to explain about default encoding. Many people who use accented characters in their web pages, things like e acute or o umlaut, are confused by the fact that Dreamweaver no longer inserts HTML entities. HTML entities begin with an ampersand and then have something like e acute or o u m l followed by a semicolon. This is no longer necessary with UTF-8. UTF-8 is an encoding that supports just about every written language in the world. But if there is a reason that you need to use HTML entities, you should change the default encoding. If you're on Windows, change to Western European. And if you're on a Mac, change to Western ISO Latin 1. Now, I strongly recommend that you don't do that, UTF-8 is becoming the international standard for encoding for web pages. So just click OK and everything is now set up to work in HTML5. The changes will be applied to all new documents, but existing documents will be unaffected unless you decide to update them manually.